just doing a uh, demo on this orange amplifier today. This is an orange uh, OR60, solid state, 112, two channels. Uh, and it's got a nice reverb in it, as you probably just heard. And it's got a mini toggle on the reverb so you can go from plate, hall, to spring, okay? We can go through those right now and get that out of the way. The uh, clean channel is just volume, bass, and treble. That's it. The uh, distorted channel has gain, volume, bass, treble, and uh, it's pretty much it. It's pretty simple. It has a, another master volume on the... Uh, dirty side as well and it has a reverb too just one knob for the uh, reverb and like I said there's a mini toggle so we're on uh, let's go down to uh, spring for us I'm gonna put it right on 10 a lot of decay roll it back a little not bad Let's go to Hall next. Again, it's got a nice long trail. Okay, uh, let's go to the uh, plate reverb next. It's got that quick kind of short attack to it, which is kind of nice. Question in it too, and I think that's why they they sound pretty decent. A lot of it is the speaker. Let's just say it. I mean, even a good tube amp with a bad speaker doesn't sound like it should. Okay, so uh, let's check out the dirty channel real quick. Hopefully, it's not on eleven, but we'll see here. <laughs> Just go from there. Okay, so here we go. CR60. I think I called it an OR60, but it's actually CR. And uh, there's the controls for the uh, clean channel and the ones for the dirty channel. And there's the uh, little toggle for your reverb, which is kind of handy, really. And it's switchable on the top of the amp with just that toggle. And it does have a foot switch capability in the back. Uh, let's take a peek at the back. I can't remember if this has effects loop in it or not. Let's take a peek. Okay, this might be a little hard to see, but that's up under the, uh, the back of the cabinet here, okay? So, it is foot switchable. And I believe there's a fuse there, another speaker out, and you switch. And I believe, that, yeah, that is Celestion, I'm quite sure. Uh, in any case, it's a really nice sounding amplifier, uh, especially for solid state. Uh, it's really clean. It's quite heavy. It has a pretty, pretty big cabinet on it, actually. And it's quite deep this way, you know. 
But all in all, really cool look, really nice sound. You don't have to worry about blowing tubes and all that stuff. So they're out there, folks. This is a, I'm going to say this is a pretty decent one for a solid state. This would be something I would look at uh, if I was going to go that route. Uh, so thanks again for watching. I really appreciate it, and I hope this helps. If you guys are uh, searching something like this, at least you can get a little bit of a read of what it sounds like and what the controls look like. All right, we'll see you guys real soon. Thanks again. Okie doke.